Hi, David O'Brien at Tame Real Estate, Team O'Brien, here to give you your monthly market update for San Rafael sold homes for December of 2022. There were 31 sold homes, that's up from 29 sold homes in November of last year, and it's down from 34 sold homes for December of 2021. The average price per square foot is at $741 a square foot. That's down 3.3% from the previous month, and it's down 4.6% from one year ago. The average days on market is 44 days. That's up from 38 days from the previous month. And the average sale price versus the original list price is at 95%. That's up 2% from the previous month, but prior to that, Prior to that being May, it had been trending down. Uh, of those 31 homes sold, 18 of them received just one offer. Uh, and of the other 13 that received multiple offers, eight of those actually received offers that were under asking, uh, which is unusual. Six months ago, and for years prior to that, if you had multiple offers, you were always gonna see the home sell for over asking. These are all indicators just that we're in a different market uh, and it's different as opposed to like May, uh, which is when we start to see things change. I expect we're gonna see things continue to slow down um, with there not being a lot of inventory, but there not being a lot of buyers. If we start to see interest rates go down, then we'll start to see more activity with more people selling because if they can sell that and get out of that interest rate, that's at 3% or 3.5% to get into something that's say four and a half, five percent, that's more tolerable than going to something that's at say six or six and a half percent. So you're gonna see fewer people selling because they don't wanna let go of that lower interest rate. And conversely, you're actually gonna see fewer people that are able to purchase because they can't, they're not able to purchase with that six or six and a half percent interest rate because it's limiting them on what they can afford. And then there's inflation. Uh, and so all these things are just gonna result in their being fewer homes on the market, but I also think fewer buyers. We're not gonna see anything crazy happen like we did 2008 through 2012 with the market dipping, unless something really crazy happens. But what the reason that that occurred is because we had many buyers that had purchased and were then owners, but they purchased with a mortgage that they really didn't qualify for. So we're not seeing that now. So I, th I expect things to just continue kind of at what they've been at. We'll see homes sell around 95% to 98% of what they're originally listed at. There will be exceptions to that. The exceptions being those sellers that take the time to update their property, uh, stage it, update it mildly on you know, carpet, maybe new flooring, paint, new countertops, dolling up the front year, yard, those kind of things. Uh, you'll still, with those types of properties, you're still gonna see multiple offers with the property selling for uh, over asking. Um, hope this finds you well. Wishing you all the best in the new year. Thank you for watching.